Hey everybody, it's Savage Sage and welcome back to my playthrough of Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Look at Miriam, she's just sitting on her throne, stoked that we ble beat the blood bitch in the last episode. She was kind of our arch rival for a while and we got the blood steel shard. I want to see how that works. Am I doing it incorrectly? Like... Um, I thought it was going to be something that we could, like, use to steal HP from enemies, pretty much. But it might just be a storyline shard, because I can already think of one place where we can use that. Remember way back at the beginning, and it was just so odd that that's why I remember it. Way back at the beginning, there was, like, that little pool that we could jump around and splash in blood. I think it was by the entrance. So we're going to go find that and hopefully soak up all that blood. That's the only thing I could assume. Red Umbrella. It's not a weapon. Yes, it is. And it's technically a sword. That's sick. So we're going to steal. We're stealing Blood Bitch's Umbrella that she was so rude with. So that's cool, actually. I'm glad that we got that. That's really sick, actually. And then this connects back to this room over here? Question mark. So we can... Hold on. Is there a false wall over here? No. Like this. I remember being over here and I was confused by this at the time. Okay. So this all connects like that. So clearly if it's all connected like that, then we have to go find that blood pool that I was talking about, right? That's the only thing I can think of. Because where else would be absorbing blood be useful? I can't think of anywhere else. Can you? No. No. I like that we're using her umbrella. That's sick as hell. That makes us badass. Good job, Miriam. The closest warp is straight south to us. So I guess that's what we'll be doing. Hello, dragon. I remember you in this room. Yes, yes. You're very scary. Actually, I was scared of you the first time we saw you. <laughs> I, that is truth. Nice. We're almost to the warp. Well, this isn't a long journey at all from this side. Freaking blood, bitch ruining lives making things difficult for us it was an issue nice well then let's take this opportunity i know i do it all the time right run back home <laughs> i just want to get some more supplies since we use literally every item we had while fighting blood bitch and then we'll go look for that uh blood pool thing that i was talking about because i think we're just like at a transitional stage right now did I get... Oh, good. You have new quest for us. Really? A glass blower now? Who else do we have to avenge? Just the sexton. Okay. And Carl! The Cooper? What, a chicken Cooper? That sounds right. We still have to fight, like, one more of each of these things that we have seen, so that's unfortunate. But I'm sure we'll run into them at some point. We always do. Dominique, I know I was just here. Sick! I was just going to ask about that. What do you have new to offer us? Because we don't have a lot of money, but let's check it out. Mm, the hoe fund, that's the same. Most of this stuff is the same, lady. Snake bite, eh. And honestly, that spear is a little bit better than the umbrella we have. Ooh, a great sword with the power of ice is actually better than the Graham, too. That might be interesting to have at some point. The Yagarish, which is a club. Well, we can actually use clubs, and it has thunder. That might be worth it, but it's only one better than the umbrella, so I don't know. Don't know why I would do that. Beret of Bravery. Is that not what we have right now? We just have the Beast Beret on. Wait, hold up. Yeah, shut up. Do I only have the Beast Beret on? Guys, what the hell? <laughs> we have a better beret. I guess it was a beret, so it just tricked me. And we still have the ring and the necklace on. Wow, how did we beat her? I was completely not equipped correctly. Well, let's remedy that now. What else do you have, lady? Yes, I forgot something. What is she calling us out for coming right back? Like that? Hello, you'd think you'd like the 
repeat customers. All right, so let's sell like all these extra weapons and shit. Like we have so many. Because really, we just want to keep the gram, and I'll keep that. Oh my gosh, we have so many partisans. And I'll keep that gun just to have. Because I have some rounds. If there's anybody super strong that we need to do that, we'll do that. The rest of these helmets are trash. So we'll sell those. The rest of this armor is trash. You're so welcome. This stuff. There's a lot of garbage in here. But we'll keep it all. Because what if it becomes useful? I don't know. I just don't know. But let's buy. We can have five high potions on us. Let's do it. Let's buy some more potions just to have. Let's buy five high ethers. Let's buy some ethers. And then, I guess, let's buy some more food. I don't know. There seems to be more crap that we could make. But I seem to need a lot of sugar for stuff I was doing. I seem to need a lot of baking soda for what I was doing. We can just buy cheese now, but we made cheese, so that was cool. And Chinese noodles. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing with the whole food thing. We'll figure it out. <laughs> it's it's fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it, friends. All right. As far as over here, good to see you too, sir. Can we enhance any of our shards? Not the oh the optimizer. I actually do kind of care about that. Let's enhance it a little bit while we can. And it doesn't seem that we can enhance. Our silver knight or the sword thing. So that's unfortunate. Sure. Thanks, man. I was going to go save, but we don't need it right now. We'll save after we explore a bit more. So where is it? It's over there. Straight to the right. So the best warp is that one over there. That blood pool is our best lead. And I actually love Miriam attacking with this umbrella. That feels so good <laughs> that we took her umbrella. That feels so good. Alright, so let's go get the freaking blood thing. It's all blood related. Because we, we literally became that lady. Like, we took all of her powers. We took her umbrella. We took her ability to steal blood from people. Like, we literally just absorbed her everything. Sucks to suck, lady. Ouch. Well, we fell really far it's fine though we remember these enemies remember back in the day when we felt a lot safer <laughs> than we are now actually no we still felt in danger when we were in this area but now it seems safe let's go ahead and take this opportunity to save before we go do some crazy stuff because we all know i'm gonna do some crazy stuff yes here's look at all that blood like it's really kind of gross, but this is the only thing that we could do here, right? Let's stand in this blood pool and just like... Wow, we just soaked it all up. That's vile. But we did it. So I guess what? We can go down here now. Ew. What is this? Is this like a blood well? Like what? Ew. I don't like what's happening here. Let's keep our eye out. There could be fake walls all around. Actually, I should check over on this side, too. Fake walls? No, I guess we're okay. What about over here? Any fake walls? Wait. Oh, I thought something broke. I was like, wait a minute. But it did not. That's just our jumping sound. No fake walls around here. Well, it looks like we're about to open up a new area, though. Where are we going? Does this place not have a name? Oh, it's an axe guy. Hello. We've seen you around. Is this connected? Oh, this is the Forbidden Underground Waterway, but from the other side. Okay. All right, we can come check this out. That makes sense. Well, this is a pretty straightforward hallway for now. Cool, cool. Hello, sir. Archdemon, come here, jerk. Thank you for dying. Oh, there's a book over here. 
penetrate with the Gondo Shizor, the Lang Yan Hu, which actually we saw the Lang Yan Hu, but just kind of that downward motion. Nice. Is this nice to save room? It seems like those bookshelves kind of indicate save rooms. Am I the only one that's noticed that? I like that. We've got 55% of the map filled out, guys. That's pretty cool. Water Leaper, no thanks. Let's check out down here. What's this way? Wow, lots of possibilities to open up. Just here in the underground passageway, so we've got lots of things to explore. Oh, another Archdemon. And what is that? Is that an eyeball on the ground? What is this? Link to the past? Actually, those were swamp eyeballs, but you guys, you understand the premise. Wow, that was a nasty ice spell. Oh, hello, eyeball man. What's your name? I guess it didn't tell us his name. Oh, well. Probably wasn't important. Let's go. I like the premise of, like, going all the way down and then filling stuff out later. <laughs> As you guys have probably noticed. Let's see what kind of ridiculous seeker is what it's called. Okay, bad fire spell by the demon. Thank you. Thank you so much for hurting us like that. Axe boy, hello. Put that axe down. Don't be throwing that kind of stuff. Berdaichi, huh? It's actually stronger, but look at how slow that is. We won't be using that, but it's nice to know that's what those guys are using, I guess. Excuse me. Wow, there's so many rooms. Part of me wants to go fill out those other rooms that we saw, but, well, I mean, we'll have plenty of time. We will be exploring all of the things. So, ooh, we got fried fish. I guess that's cool. Because, see, a bunch of them are probably just rooms like that, so I guess I should have explored them while we were back over there, but we're cool with it. Part of it is I like that there's always the possibility that we have another area to go, you know? Alright, it looks like we're going to be stopped by our whole lack of swimming here. Ew, what is that? You stay the hell away from me. An underwater horse? What the hell is that? Oh, I like how it does like the underwater like noise when she casts stuff underwater. That's funny. I like that. That was a nice detail game. But maybe if I can jump across here. Oh, it's a warp room. Honestly, I don't need that right now, but that's nice to have. And it's nice for us to know where it is. What did I just... Oh, summon that. We don't care about that. Hello, horse. Sorry, it's just because I have to. Nice. Well, we killed the horse. So we can't go down over here until we can swim. Because clearly we're going to be able to swim at some point, right? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He literally, like... That was rude. We didn't like that at all. Can I still use this out here? Seems to be ineffective. So how the hell am I supposed to get up, huh? Oh, from like up here. Okay, cool. So eventually we'll clearly be able to swim. But now, now we backtrack and see, maybe this is the upside of, like I said, leaving those pop possibilities open. We have places to go now. People to see. No, thank you on that fire spell, Archdemon. And we're actually... We're going to have to go back to that save room here soon. Because we're getting a little low on the HPs. I'll keep an eye on it. We'll use a high potion if we have to. But I'd rather not. Hello, Water Leaper. Can you stay away from me, please? Thank you. Non none of that. Oh, the underground waterway is so creepy. What's over here? Some new stuff we're finding out. Bats and Water Leapers. Gross. What is this chest? Platinum. That's good for what's his face, the Silver Knight, right? Is that it? It was just for that chest. Okay, cool. Well, I'm glad we got that platinum and filled out that much of the map. Seeker, you're evil. You just ran through us. That's not cool. Archdemon, I'm kind of worried about you sometimes. I don't want you doing some weird crap to us, okay? Like fire. We're trying to avoid that. Oh, I got an achievement hunter demon. I mean, achievement demon hunter. Cool. I'm cool with that. Let's go up to that save room now. Heal ourselves up. Watch out. Bats and such. Dude, that silver knight, when he shoots those rays and stuff, that's some good stuff. He is super useful. All right, let's save ourselves up real quick. We needed the HP and the saving. So let's keep exploring. Let's go up first. Screw those water leapers, dude. They're kind of rude. Screw that archdemon, too. What is this way? 
inquiring minds would like to know. Because I'm assuming we're going to run into another boss eventually and then they'll give us the swimming ability question mark. Not sure. We'll figure out. Oh my gosh, that boy was getting all knocked around. We'll figure it out later. No secret walls. Disappointing. Oh, okay. This connects to... Wow. Good job. This connects to the other side of this, where we pretty much have this room filled out now. But we still can't even... Ah, uh, stay away from me, fishy. Still can't even navigate it, because we can't underwater. Well, that's cool. At least we have that part of the map filled out, and we see where it all connects. I guess that's nice. Stay away from us. I wonder what this underground waterway is going to offer for us, though. This umbrella is literally my favorite weapon we've had so far. I don't know, the invisible blade was kind of cool, too, but... This umbrella is sick. Just because of how we got it, who we got it from, and I, I mean, we're badasses. It's sick. It's a good story for us. Move out of my way. What's this way? Yes, yes, yes. We need to break all of the things, get all of the monies. Oh, this is one of those traveler rooms. Rooms. I prefer to rock, walk right now, thank you. But this means it's going to take us deeper? Question mark. Not sure. Wow, okay, so this room's actually kind of big because it looks like it splits off this way, too. Oh, nope, just some chests. 500 and a rose ring. What is that? Let's check it out. Rose ring. A ring that increases the amount of magic restored by mana roses. Hmm, that could be useful running around, but I like the cut purse thing better. There's lots of stuff worth a shit ton of money, and they literally don't give you much money in this game at all. So, we're going to be holding on to that. There has to be a fake wall up there, right? Right? No? Fine, I guess we know nothing. That's fine. We're not even picking up our money. There we go. Just talking about how few and far in between it is, and then I don't even pick it up when they give it to me? That has to be a fake wall, right? Yes, it is. Okay, thank goodness. Critical ring. I think we already had one of those. Yeah, we did. Increases the likelihood of critical hits. Now, that might be better than the cut purse ring. Actually, I should have maybe had that for... I'll keep that for tough bosses. Okay. Oh, I thought those rocks were going to block us. I was like, sick. What are we going to do about that? Nothing, I guess. Getting lots of those bat shards. If I still use summon bat, I'd probably be ecstatic about it. But I don't use summon bat anymore. Words of wisdom. Oh, that's what we... Lowers our AP, right? We like that one. No thick wall there. That's rude. Let's check this bottom left. It looks like it could maybe be like the placement of it. It could maybe be a save room. Because if it is, I want to uncover that. Shovel Knight, no. Get out of here. You're in the wrong game. Nope, it's just a treasure room, though. So I guess I'm glad we came back for it. Mahogany. That's good for the Welcome Company spell, I'm pretty sure. If I'm remembering correctly, which I'm probably not. But look at that. Our Welcome Company, each one of those is hitting those guys for 30, and then our sword hits them for 40. So this Welcome Company spell has gotten OP. We love it, obviously. Alright, what else could be around here? Nasty frogs and treasure chests. Sick. 500 gold. Thank you so much for that, little bat skis. Ouch. Get out of here, Archdemon. And then, so what I'm understanding, right? Let's check it out. Oh, good. I really wanted that frog. Summon Water Leaper. I don't know why I would do that. But if I had... Blood steel equipped and all this blood right here, I could pick it up and heal myself. Yes. Wow, that's really not worth it. <laughs> I guess it's good for that one spot, but and we've only seen a couple of enemies that make blood, and we've commented on it before because it is gross. I've seen it. So I've commented, but it doesn't look like it's even gonna heal you that much. Like, look, that guy gave us a little spatter of blood when we killed him. Is that really worth it? No. No, no, no. Not useful. So that's unfortunate. 
another arch demon though could be useful i like their shards because that makes the mana consumption go down right if i'm thinking of the right shard so hello we need that in our life we only use welcome company every 10 seconds so might be useful so it looks like the map is going to connect over here too so i'm interested in getting that connection filling that part of the map out real quick speaking of filling that part of the map oh there's a little okay okay i wouldn't have noticed that before Oh, it looks like an underground, uh, I mean underground, underwater area that we can't explore too much of yet. Oh my gosh, those water horses are scary. But hey, at least we could do something there. At least to get across. It seems like this underground waterway connects to like everywhere. So that's nice. Oh, we still can't swim, brothers, otherwise I would do that. Hello? Did I, like... I, like... She's stuck. Let's get out of there. <laughs> I don't know what she was doing. I kind of wanted to... I was excited to go maybe check out that save room over there. Because we haven't saved in a hot minute. But we can't even swim over there. So, never mind. Never mind. So, let's keep exploring. Oh, we can't explore this room. This is a water room. Wow, we're... There's going to be a lot of places in this place specifically that will open up once we get the swimming ability. So that will be nice. We'll just keep moving on. Screw you guys. Oh, this is a save room right here. So that's pretty cool. We still have some time to go, so we'll keep exploring this underground waterway. But where? Up, up there. I was like, where am I going to be able to go? But up to the top right. There's a place to go. So we'll have to explore that because we're pretty much, what, at this point, just in search of whatever demon we're going to have to kill to get the shard to swim. I mean, that's that's where we're at. Unless I'm supposed to use that laser to navigate through the water, potentially, because I've thought about it. But I don't... I don't know. The areas that it has us going through doesn't look like that would be viable. Here's a false wall if I've ever seen one. Capacity up. Thank you so much. We don't really use that, but thanks. It is nice to be able to just hit all of the false walls, too, with the welcome company. We can leap through there with this. Don't even worry. Don't try to fool me, game. And then this opens to right here. Which connects over here somehow. Okay. But we still can't swim. So, like, what? Over here, it looked like we needed to swim. Unless I could maybe laser over here. That's a possibility. I'm trying to look through the other ways to navigate through this place. Over here, we definitely needed to swim. And over here we needed to swim and we're connected up here. So I'm not seeing how how that's going to work out for us. But let's head back. Question mark. Because I'm a little confused now. Because like I said, I really thought we were going to move forward, find a demon that would teach us how to swim. Or we could get a shard to swim or whatever we needed to do. And then go from there. But we're really kind of stuck in most of these areas until we can get swimming so we're clearly missing something or there's like a area that i can laser into the water to just get under a buoy that's something i could see happening too leading to the right way so let's let's check it out let's check out all of our possibilities hello archdemon i'm really trying to kill these archdemons yeah i was gonna say we haven't gotten a level up in forever i was literally gonna say that so i'm glad that we got that we deserve a level up damn it we really do, though. Miriam works hard, okay? She deserves a level up. Um, This room is boring. <laughs> There's literally nothing happening right now. This is the lifty room hunt. Sorry, guy. We need your ride, so you got to get out of here. Sorry I chopped off all your limbs. Something might reveal itself to us while we're up here, too. That could always happen. But it doesn't look like it. It looks like it's pretty straightforward. Pretty damn straightforward, if I do say my so myself. Yeah, no secrets, no nothing were revealed there. So, oh well. That's cool, that's cool. So now that we're back over here by the save room, we might as well save, right? Just to have it. With our experience or whatever. Just smart to hit the save rooms. Get out of here, frog. Whatever. Stay away from me. 
You freaking nasty frog. But we'll take that save. Dang, we're almost to 60% of the map, guys. That's good. We're doing real good. Alright, so the only thing I could think of, right? The only thing that I'm plotting at this point is going down here and using the laser to get through something. Come on, give me another shard, bud. Dang, he didn't do it. He wasn't down for listening today. That's unfortunate. Ouch, I got stoned. That's usually a good thing, tee -hee. Um, Let's see here. Nice, I did get another shard from him, though. Another words of wisdom, that's great. Great news, great news. Because, yeah, I mean, I'm not missing anything on the map, right? There's, like, no other places I can go other than... Like, if I came down here and did some fancy... Fanciness, you know? To try to get underneath that. Because maybe Miriam can hold her breath if I can just get her underneath. Doesn't really look viable there. Actually, that looks like the end of that one. So let's try the same trick, but down here? Question mark. I don't know how that would work, but... <laughs> it's worth a shot, damn it. Or I can stand here, so what if I could, like... Or have those guys rock at me somewhere? I don't understand. Yeah. This is very interesting. Killed the horse just for the fun of it. But then I don't understand, like, it's just this warp room all by itself. And what does this warp room suggest to us? That, like, go somewhere else? I don't know where else there was a shit ton of blood. So I'm kind of confused there, to be honest with you. I'm a bit confused at this point. But that being said, I guess we'll end the episode off here, guys. And we will figure it out in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Bloodstain. Make sure to hit that like button down below. Show show the support for the series. The support always means a lot. So thank you so much every time you guys do that. Subscribe to the channel so you can see more content like this. And I will see you guys. I will see you guys in the next episode.